today I'm bringing you a gift. Oh, uh, Jesse. It's a photograph of us the first time we met in Boston. And, you know, it's a gift of friendship. It's a beginning of friendship. It was a great beginning, and, and it just symbolizes what, you know, 261 and friendship is all about. It's breaking the barriers, it's creating unity, and the barriers of age, of ability, of cultures, of race. How wonderful. It's a great start. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Hey, I've got some friends that 261 Fearless have brought together. Let's go chat with them. Oh yeah, great, I'd love to meet them. Let's go. Great, let's go. Joanne Flaminio, the first woman president of the Boston Athletic Association in 125 years. Wow, that's amazing. It Thank is. You. Thank you. So, Joanne, welcome to Berlin, and here is a gift of friendship from 261 Fearless Running. Love gifts. Love yeah. gifts. Okay. This will surprise you. This photo is Catherine crossing the finish line at the 2017 Boston Marathon. Uh, at the completion of her 50th anniversary run uh, in celebration of what happened in 1967. It was the happiest day of my life, and to have Joanne there, to see her, when I began running down toward the finish line, I saw her and my husband. I said, who do I kiss first? <laughs> <laughs> oh, look who's here, I don't believe it. Hi. All the way from Kansas City, yeah. Melissa. Wonderful to see you. Good to see you too. Great. Oh, <laughs> I remember this photo. This is at my Train the Trainer session in Denver. Train the Trainer. Can you tell me a little bit about what that is? I can. So Train the Trainer is a weekend session, and 261 Fearless sends out master coaches to train other women to be coaches in their own communities. Um, I made some long-lasting friendships there. The uh, first night, we go to dinner together. And I come down in the elevator and I walk in and I sit down and I'm a little nervous initially. Mm -hmm. um, but all these other women start joining me and I just felt immediately comfortable with them. It was a very warm feeling. And we went to dinner and we came back and we got up really early the next morning. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and we went for a meet run mm -hmm. and we learned all about each other. And I'm still friends with those women today. Wow. <laughs> wow. After having been here for six months. Ah, wow. Christina. Oh, yeah. It's nice wonderful to see you. Welcome yeah. to Berlin. Thank you. Oh. Yeah, I'm looking at you. Yeah, well, we had there a big meeting with the local 261 clubs from Switzerland, Austria, and Germany. Mm -hmm. And yeah, it was a great to coming together. And they're all mothers. Yeah. So, so they all have the same issues and problems of balancing their lives and exactly. managing the house and jobs and kids and dogs and everything. Yeah, yeah. And as we run at uh, 6 p.m., that's dinner time in Dresden. Somebody has to look after the children. Somebody right. has to prepare dinner. Mm -hmm. But um, that's really a good time because they really have a time off. Right. Oh, that's right. great. Yes. 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 But yeah, we had a great time together. Oh, look who's here! Yeah. Oh. Hi! Oh, it's so good to see you. So good to see you. All Hi. the way from Klagenfurt, Austria. Hey. And we've got a present for you from the 261. Thank yes. you. Oh! <laughs> Tell us about this photo. Yeah, this photo was taken uh, just a few months ago when uh, women from three different countries came together so from Austria, Switzerland and Germany and they formed a very strong bond through 261 Fearless and became friends through running. So this was really awesome. Was that the first meeting? Yes, I mean at this occasion I would say most of the women met the first time mm -hmm. and we spent three days there and when we left they really became close friends and um, I think without 261 Fearless they wouldn't have met at all but now they are chatting via the internet or even, yeah, train together or 
form different kinds of friendship.